Okay, this is part two of practicing adding, subtracting, multiplying, and dividing fractions and mixed numbers. First thing I like to do is take a picture using the snipping tool. Dun, 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 dun. If you don't have a snipping tool, do this on a piece of paper. Then I want you to underline the important parts. Doug has four-fifths of a cup of powdered sugar. He sprinkles two-fifths of the sugar onto a plate of brownies, yum, and sprinkles the rest onto a plate of lemon cookies. How much does Doug sprinkle on the brownies? So let's remind ourselves. Okay, so this is the amount he sprinkles on the brownies. How much sugar? He starts with a cup of four-fifths of powdered sugar. He sprinkles two-fifths on a plate of brownies and sprinkles the rest on a plate of lemon cookies. How much sugar does Doug sprinkle on the brownies? Kind of think this is a trick question. Two-fifths. Let's see if I'm right. Maybe I'm wrong. If I'm wrong, it'll show me why. Yep, it shows me why. Doug sprinkles. You answered two-fifths. It's eight over 25. Four-fifths cup brownies. Simplify your answer into a proper fraction or mixed number. Doug sprinkles two-fifths of the cup of four fifths. So he took he took two fifths out. So that's why you multiply them. You'd multiply across eight over 25. I get it. Please, if you get something wrong, make sure you read why you got it wrong. Use this website to your advantage. It teaches you how to do it if you get it wrong. So let's click got it now that we've got it. And let's try again. See, even teachers get it wrong sometimes. New. Take a picture. A factory uses an eighth of a barrel of raisins in each batch of granola bars. Yesterday, the factory used one fourth of a barrel of raisins. How many batches of granola bars did the factory make yesterday? Ooh. Edit. Copy. Come down here. Paste. Okay, so uses one eighth for each batch of granola bars. I guess we'll call this a barrel. Every time they make a batch of granola bars, it's they've used up one eighth of um, they use one eighth of a barrel. So yesterday they got one fourth used up. How many batches of granola bars did the factory make? So one eighth times something, some number of batches, one eighth times mystery number, we'll call it B for batches equals one fourth total total um, barrels used. We don't know what this mystery number is, so we could just plug in here and try to figure it out. Like if we plugged in a two, let's say, or a three. First, let's try, I always try the easiest number first. So let's try two. Remember I showed you that there's a mystery one underneath every whole number. So don't forget to put that in. One times two is two. We're just going to put it right here. Eight times one is eight. See, that doesn't equal one fourth, but we need to make sure we reduce though. So if I divided two by two over two, which is actually a fraction we're allowed to divide by because two halves is the same thing as saying one whole pizza. So two over two is actually dividing by one. And if you divide by one, you keep the number the same. So two divided by two is one, and eight divided by two is four. So I was correct. The number that, the number of batches they made, the B, that we're looking for is two. Now I'm gonna cross my fingers that I got it right. Mm -hmm.
Phew. All right. <laughs>